By visiting South Sudan to meet the president face to face, the United Nations Security Council was sending a strong message that the fighting has to stop. This Security Council visit comes in a way as an emergency visit uh, to this country to underscore to uh, the leadership here just how important uh, it is to follow through on the commitments made to put together a transitional uh, governing body in the run-up uh, to elections. The Security Council reaffirmed the threat of consequences if the fighting did not cease. The Security Council expresses its readiness to consider all appropriate measures, including targeted sanctions, against those who take action that undermines the peace, stability and security of South Sudan. Earlier, the Security Council met with officials from the UN's mission in South Sudan, or UNMIS. It heard the grave warning that despite a lull in violence, UNMIS believes warring factions are using the rainy season as a time to rearm and regroup. And before they left the South Sudan capital of Juba, a closed-door meeting with the opposition leader Rick Machar, where they delivered a, quote, tough message that the violence will no longer be tolerated. Nick Harper, CCTV. Juba.